Hey everyone, well let's take a minute tonight and talk about toners, okay? Because as many of y'all know, you know, what toners do several things, okay? But as many of y'all know, you know, uh, the main reason why you wanna want a toner is because of maybe you're trying to control the pimples, you're trying to control excess oil, okay? That's normally the main reason why you're gonna be using a toner, okay? So, you know, hormones can affect your the oiliness of your skin as well as just, um, you know, just, you know, teens, you know, because of extra excess oil that your skin produces. When you're teens, um, you get the acne prone skin, but then really, like I said, hormonal, I mean, some, you could be 40 or 50, you know, and still be getting um, blemishes on your skin, okay? And so I have found that to these toners have really made a difference for me, for my skin, okay, because of just the excess oil that, that I will get, okay? And so what a toner does is it removes excess oil from your skin, okay? Number one, it removes excess oil. Number two, um, it, it acts like an exfoliator, okay? A very mild exfoliator. And it kind of, it, it cleans the pores out and then it, and it tightens the pores, okay? And so that's really, really good. And what happens is, you know, when you get a blemish or something, that didn't just pop up overnight. Like that is because of a clogged pore, that you've had for several days, okay? And so this will just really help clean the pores out, okay? And so, of course, as well as control and shine. So we have this one, this toner right here, and this is the Clear Proof Toner. Now this toner um, has 2% salicylic acid in it, okay? So this has a little bit more of a drying effect to it, okay? And so if you have, um, acne prone skin where you have you, you, you get blemishes um, frequently and you have that excess production of oil this would be the choice that I would pick for you okay it would be this and of course you do this after cleansing the skin okay you can do it morning you can do it night but it, it is drying okay so you know you have to kind of watch it um, you might not be able to use it daily you might not be able to use it twice a day you have to just kind of watch and see okay so this is one toner that if I actually have blemishes, I'm like, oh, let me just kind of like dry out my skin really well um, and kind of, you know, clean the pores out really good and I'll use this one. But what I use on a daily basis that I really, really like is this botanical, okay? I love this because it does the same thing but without the salicylic acid. It actually has dragon fruit in it. It has the, um, it has uh, aloe in it witch hazel in it so it really does it does you know it's a toner so it does give you that um uh it does remove excess oil okay which what toners do it does clean the pores out and close the pores it does all the things but with the aloe in it it just it doesn't leave your skin dry so i can use this twice a day okay and so um but also if you find that okay you know, I'm getting pimples every now and then, you know, maybe once a week or let's say once every other week, okay? That might make you feel like, okay, I need to cleanse more. I need to cleanse better. I need to get rid of the oil. So you're gonna wanna use a toner, okay? So toners really are great. Um, just really for that excess oil production, it's really good. You can use it every day. Um, you can use them both every day. It depends on your skin, okay? So this one sells for 20. This one sells for 18. But if you're having difficulty with excess oil or with blemishes or acne on your skin, I would definitely consider a toner, okay? So if you have any questions, go ahead and put them in the comments. I'll be happy to answer them and get with your consultant and maybe grab you a toner. If you're having some, um, some um, late, late age, you know, if you're my age or whatever, you're having some acne, um, that would be probably the, the one thing that maybe you may not be doing because, or skincare, you know, or it does have some of the um, toning properties to it, okay, without using an additional toner, but you sometimes just need a little extra, okay, and so that's okay too. So, I hope y'all learned something about toners and if you might need one or not, um, ask your consultant and she'll help you out. Bye everyone.